What's going on Flippers? John here at Flipper Dollar and uh, I decided to make a video of what it's like to be a full-time reseller on eBay and being a um, uh, single dad at the same time. Uh, you know, uh, if you could see the red in my eyes, I'm pretty tired. Um, I wish I could say that it's an easy task, but it's not. Um, and especially with the world that it is today in the uh, uh, the Rona and all that stuff like that uh, being out of school um, it changes uh, a few dynamics and I'll explain to you why a little bit so um, that is my profession I sell full-time on eBay um, I have no other job or anything except for my business and I just started doing this about two months ago and I'm diving headfirst I am uh, 40 hours a week I wish no I am <laughs> um, I'm doing way more than that um, I I'm a single dad so I have him 50% of the time um, so when he's with his mom you know it's you know business like normal um, uh, just hustle get things listed shipped you know normal routine uh, but I do bust my butt um, now when I have him, well that's the difficult time because he he just turned uh, nine years old about a week ago and um, he is my life, my world, my everything. I do everything for him and so it's really hard because when I'm working and he's like, dad do this, dad come here, dad, you know. Um, I, I do take some times and go spend time with him because like I said he's my everything but I also got to keep in mind that if I don't work, uh, bills aren't paid. So I, I let him know. I'm like, look, man. So I give him a schedule kind of like work. So I tell him, hey, buddy, you know, I will take breaks here and there and spend some time with you. But, you know, at five o'clock, I'm yours and we can do whatever, play video games, hang out, watch TV. Um, but until that time comes, I've got to work. And he... He says okay, and he's a real sweetheart about it and everything, but I think at the end of the day, he doesn't, you know, wrap his head around that. So it's just like, Dad, come on. Dad, 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 Dad. So, um, and uh, the other thing, too, is uh, because I'm such a marshmallow uh, for my boy, is um, um, toys, video games, stuff like that, they sell great. However, my boy sees it, and it's like, Dad... I want it dad I want to keep it and um, I'm a sucker so you know he's got like every toy in the world because <laughs> not only going to the store and buying it for him because I cave in but every time you see something cool um, you know he wants to keep it um, I bought a vintage uh, gumball machine uh, I picked it up for 50 bucks it's worth like about 150 bucks or more and sure enough he was like dad and well he has a vintage gumball machine now so it's it's yeah <laughs> it's um i know there's other single parents out there doing the hustle too as well so i know you guys you feel the strain and everything just as well too um selling on ebay is a little bit trickier than a lot of people make it seem you know um because you you really got to hustle especially in the beginning so I mean like my minimum goal is like a thousand listings um, like I said I've been doing it for about two months now I got like 600 and something I need to get more um, but doing it full time it's it's a hard job because my goal is to sell like 40 things a day which it's up and down it, it, I do that don't do it um, but you got to keep in mind you have to buy 40 things a day list 40 things a day and in the beginning not in the beginning well yeah especially in the beginning it's it's a grind um it's a lot of work i put a lot of hours in i work on weekends um i'm hitting up everything um trying to get the best deals at auctions estates yard sales um i have a facebook marketplace um i have a uh resell uh wholesaler that i work with um, you guys probably seen some of the other videos and stuff like that where I get some of the materials and that's a little bit complicated too because you know he did not being in school because summer um, and also when you know the whole Rona thing went down 
um, when he's with me, um, the, the place that I go to, they have certain time slots where they raffle off items. So in other words, they don't put it out on the floor and you can't just go buy it and stuff like that because they know that it's hot items. So um, about 50 people go and uh, you put your name on it and stuff like that if you want that item. And they call you, your name, you win it, and if they don't, you don't. And that's really rough too because, you know, of course, A, they don't want children in there. B, I don't want him in there. So when I have him, it's, you know, I don't, I really don't have a sitter or anything like that. And I kind of don't want it to be, uh, you know, have a sitter because I want to be there for him during the times that I have. So it's like really hard because like when I need to go to somewhere like that and I need to be there like tomorrow, um, they, at, I get, I get my boy at three o'clock and sure enough, the raffle is at three o'clock. And they have certain different raffles too. Um, my my dude uh, that works there, he texts me every single day, lets me know what kind of raffle. And well, you know, most of the time it's like, eh, I'm gonna pass. And then they have like the good ones. Uh, like if you guys saw the video game uh, haul that I got, um, you know, I, I need to be there for those because that's just amazing, easy money to be made. And I they have one of those tomorrow at three and I'm, I just can't go. Um, so. It really does cut into your grind um, as far as getting that stuff done. Um, it's it, it's a rough go, but now now that I keep saying that it's rough and it's hard and all that stuff like that, there is the pleasantries. The pleasantries are, you know, I do do eBay full time, so when I do have them, I can be around them, I can hang out with them, I can spend the time. Uh, the times where I want to take a day and not work and just hang out with him and take him to Chuck E. Cheese or do anything like that. I have that freedom to be like, okay, look, man, I'm not going to work today. Um, I'm going to be with him. And um, so at that point, I am able to spend more time with him than uh, somebody with a job, you know, nine to five and stuff like that. Because they, you can't, you can't really have that option, you know, working nine to five. You can't just be like, you know what, I'm, I'm just going to hang out with my kids, you know, here and there. I mean, you can and people do, but I have the liberty of doing it whenever and however I want to. So that part I wouldn't change. Um, that's one of the reasons why I wanted to do this business motto, um, is so that I have that liberty, that opportunity to spend as much time with him as I can. Um, I'm not getting any younger. Um, he's not getting any younger. So I definitely, you know, value that time and want to hang out with him when I want to. Um, just the other day, you know, he wanted to play some Minecraft with me because he really li loves Minecraft, but he doesn't want to play it alone. He wants to only play it with Dad. And, you know, it's in the middle of the afternoon. I'm working and stuff like that. And he gives me those puppy dog eyes, please, you know, and I quit what I was doing and just went and played some Minecraft with him just because, you know, he, he touches that little heart string and, uh, you know, I want to go and check it out and be with them so I would you know I'm able to do that so as much as it is hard um, while having him there are pleasantries too as well so I mean there's I mean being able to be there for him is, is like the biggest thing and uh, you know also being a single dad um, too as well um, time slots okay so when he does go back out of school he gets out at three. Well, if I'm working a regular full-time job. I'm not out of work at three. So it's like, what do you do there? You know, you got to pay for, you know, childcare uh, after hours or somebody, you know, pick them up, stuff like that. So I, I don't have to do that. So he needs to be dropped off and, you know, his school starts at like nine o'clock. So same thing. Most jobs you start at eight. So there's that whole thing. So you got to pay for the, you know, before school care or whatever they call it. And then, I don't, I don't have to do that. I can take him when he needs and pick him up when he needs and that's that. So that's one of the reasons why I did do this um, is so I can spend all that time with him um, when, I, when I can and want to. But at the end of the day, you, you, you do have to realize you have to work, you have to grind, you have to make a living. Um, it's not, you know, simple, throw up a couple items and you're going to make a killing and live off of that. No, man, you have to hustle, you have to work eight hours plus, especially in the beginning, you know, after that, when you get routines and you have sources coming in, stuff like that, which I'm getting there and getting better, um, you can relax a little bit more, but in the beginning, no, man, you got to work, you got to grind, you know, um, dating life, there's no, there's no such thing, <laughs> 
So anyways, guys, um, I hope that you liked the video. Uh, if you did, give me a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't yet, subscribe. It really helps out of YouTube, uh, us YouTubers. So if you guys see somebody creating content and you like their content, you know, leave a comment. Like, subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything but a couple of seconds to do that. And if you want to see their other content and stuff like that, like some of the, you know, hauls that I've told you guys about, you'll be able to do that. You just hit the click all button uh, under the subscription so you can get all the feeds. Um, I appreciate you guys' time. Uh, hopefully you guys maybe learned something for that. Share your own stories with me. I do respond to all comments, so if you want to tell me something or ask a question, feel free to. Um, if you guys want to see this kind of stuff that I sell, my eBay store is down there, and you want to take a look and see what I'm doing, uh, feel free. Um, again, thanks, Flippers, and I'll see you in the next video. And...